Hello friends, thank you for stopping by for today's nugget, Crucible of Purification. In the purification of silver, the silver smith holds the silver in the hottest part of the flame to allow the heat to burn away the impurities while leaving the pure silver behind. The purpose of the flames is not to destroy the silver, rather is to burn away the impurities. The silversmith holds the silver in the flame and doesn't take his eyes off it until it's pure enough for him to see his reflection in it. In the same way, Malachi 3 verse 3, describe God sit as a refiner and a purifier. He will hold us in the flames, not to burn us or hurt us, but to drain away the impurities in our characters. God's refining and testing processes may feel like a crucible. We experience pain as God allows circumstances to bring our sins to our attention. This may be a cherished thing we have heard on for a long time. And through testing and trial, God calls us to leave those cherished sins behind. He may have tried to bring this sin to our attention several times before, but perhaps we have not listened. We have not repented. We have not surrendered completely to him. And so, as he did with ancient Israel, he brings us into the fairness of affliction to get our attention. His intention is not to burn or hurt us, but to reveal the sin to wake us from our lethargy, to bring the sin to our attention and invite us to walk away from it. If you are walking through a crucible of purification today, remember, God has his eyes on you. He won't forget you. He won't allow the flames to overwhelm you. He is not out to hurt you, but to strengthen and purify your faith. And that is the nugget. Thank you for stopping by. Study your lesson and I will see you tomorrow.